We are back, ladies and gentlemen, with more wrestling action here on NCWA assignment number seven. To continue the heavyweight the heavyweight division in the league challenge, Tom Sever will meet Scott Sampson one on one. And Rick, are you excited about this match? Absolutely, let's not waste any more time as we've got more wrestling as Ringer has said it. And I'm very interested about this match because Tom Sever still wrestles for No Mercy Hardcore Wrestling, but he's been training the young stars of the Academy, and I think Scott Sampson is going to get the education he deserves. I'm looking forward to seeing who scores three points. Absolutely, Rick Rocker. I'm excited about it too. Scott Sampson is definitely the youngest buck here, but for all we know, he might even teach. He might even he might even school Tom Sever in this matchup. The bell has rung, and here we go, ladies and gentlemen, the continuation of the heavyweight division's league challenge. This should be a lot of fun, ladies and gentlemen. I'm looking forward to this one. Oh, what the hell happened there? I think Tom was supposed to go for a Lutez press. And that, that backfired. His plan backfired. Beautiful headbutt. Ending switch by Tom Sever. Back. Once again, I apologize for the lagging. There's nothing much that I can do about it, but hopefully this does not carry on for the rest of the match and having it even more slow than it already is. Wow, look at that. Tom Sever, Tom Driver, nicely done.
and gentlemen, a uh, slight change of plans here in this contest. Raul Duke has entered the ring to help out Stenson, who is in Dr. Straits. As Tom Sever was on the verge of victory. But this two on one disadvantage for Tom Sever is not going to last long there. I think someone's going to come out to help out. And I don't know who will come out to help out in the mix, but this is this is going to cost the League Challenge some serious points here. Because the first person, the first superstar to earn 21 points will go up for their respective division's champion titles. So since, since this is the heavyweight division, the individual who scores 21 points or, or the highest points amongst everybody else, they the challenge the world heavyweight champion which is Keegan Yamato. But now the tables have turned Tom Sever's stamina is getting to the blue green mode. Raul Duke is still in here. Will he from the backstage area come out and interfere is the question. Oh, look at this. Raul Duke earlier tonight lost. He didn't get pinned. He didn't, he didn't forfeit. But his partner, Dr. Gonzo, got like double power bomb. Look at this. Look at the, look at Scott Sampson and Raul Duke go at it. They're, they're really dissecting Tom Sever here. With the outside interference, though, where I mean, I can't see how challenge uh, is fair. Nothing like a fair, and you know that very, very well. STF! STF! Can Tom Sever? Oh, he reaches the road break. I was going to say, well, he actually forfeit, but in this case here, he's doing fine and dandy. Oh, look at this suplex attempt! Tom Sever is looking very bad, fans. Oh no, make a wish, Tom. Oh, he's definitely in the danger zone. Will somebody in the backstage area come out and help Tom Sever?
Just like that, ladies and gentlemen, that's all she wrote. Scott Samson survived. Scott Samson scored a pinball victory. And let's check out the instant replay shot this. Oh, big slam. That was the, uh, that's the Mark Henry movie. The world's, the world's strongest slam or something like that. Very impressive, but of course, the outside interference made a very big deal. Raul Duke's interference played a role in this. But of course, Victoria Rome helped out Tom Sever as well. So, as a result, ladies and gentlemen, Scott Sampson scores three points. Meanwhile, Tom Sever has scored zip. And uh, we'll, we'll take a quick commercial break, ladies and gentlemen, here, and we'll be right back with more wrestling action here at NCWA Assignment Number 7. <laughs> 